Well, we have just crashed the uh, exclusive private opening here for the exhibition of Ed Kineholtz's Roxy here at David's Winter. We're going to see how long we go before they throw us out. I believe this is one of the installations that he created uh, towards the end of his career, but yeah, this is great. It kind of looks like a uh, low-rent California hotel from the late 60s, maybe early 70s, and he's got some of his little sculptures in here as well. Well, I actually think it's great that uh, not only Ed Kineholtz, but the whole group of the Ferris artists are beginning to get a lot of attention here in New York. And I believe Ed Kineholtz died about 10 or 12 years ago at this point, but uh, they, uh, I think, are doing work that is very relevant to what a lot of young artists are doing these days. It's like the abject and the pathetic before people had a name for it. Back then it was just funk with a small case F. Well, I'm doing pretty well so far. They haven't asked me to leave. This is nice. It looks like you're Local art critic here, I wonder where his notepad is. What's on the jukebox? And what do we have? Saturday Evening Post, 1943. American Magazine. I imagine it probably took them a couple of weeks to uh, build the enclosure here and do the installation. Well, maybe we better get out while the getting's good. So this is James Calm at the exclusive private opening of Ed Kineholtz's Roxy's at Daffod's Werner.